So once again, XSplit decided to completely crash on me. At least it's not my entire computer this time. Can somebody please, please help me with this? I do not understand why it keeps doing this. You know, why is it that, you know, everyone else can use this damn program? All I'm doing is using, you know, sources and type the URL or click browse to select an HTML file. It gives me the address for my, uh, for the file where my, um, my XSplit videos are kept on my computer, even though, like I said, my computer did not crash, so it should still have the URL of this video as the most recent thing. Anyway, I was going to okay, take go. it back All clear. to where I had been. No. Skip ad. Study Strange's mentor was slain by a creepy hentai monster. Yes, of course it was. was granted the title of Sorcerer Supreme, which is like a normal sorcerer with all the time. Okay, so okay. As Sorcerer Supreme, Strange was deemed the most powerful magic user and defender of the world. I love, I'm to digging that. Perform so his duties, he carries numerous magical artifacts which assist him. Okay. So, Vangaru Master, whatever, cut through mystical beings. The axe and Guru Ruman. That axe in my ex wife's old witch game. I mean apartment. Okay. Wait. Oh, oh, oh okay. It's good. But most versatile That's where of we all work. is the Eye of Agamo. Oh my god, no. Stop it. Oh, no. With this amulet, Strange can perceive any truth, absorb massive amounts of energy, enhance his psychic powers. Okay, what the shit? It just, it cut out the webcam. I don't understand this. Somebody help. I mean it. Okay, in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, the Eye of Agamotto merely contains an Infinity Stone. This is untrue in Strange's primary comic continuity, where the Eye instead possesses its own power. Now the webcam keeps cutting in and out. What am I supposed to do? I got a bird walking all over my butt. This is ridiculous! <sighs> Fine. There are lights that can weaken and obliterate magical entities. If you haven't noticed, Doctor Strange is super powerful. He's gonna With all this magical mumbo jumbo, he's taking on some of the biggest threats in the universe. Set me free! No. I've come to bargain. And if he ever gets stuck, okay. he basically just rewrites the rules of reality, which is probably what happens when you divide by zero. That's not even possible. Exactly! It's magic whiz! <laughs> Anything can happen! Strange's <clears throat> astral form has traveled across the planet in, quote, precious seconds, putting him at several million miles per hour. Even better, when Adam Warlock once used an infinity gem to bring Adam Strange Warlock. to the far reaches of the universe, Strange just cast a spell that zoomed him all the way back. So yeah, F you, Adam. Given what we see here, Doctor Strange was most likely sent to a void, or a large empty area between galaxies. The void where our galaxy resides is the about void. 2 billion light years in diameter, with the Milky Way set relatively close to the center. The Based on Strange's down, conversation back. here, we can assume a generously short time frame of 5 seconds. Okay. So, Strange must have moved over 4.2 septillion miles per hour. That's well, that's not even the times the speed of light. Damn! Oh, how about that time Ooh, he ripped the soul out of his arch nemesis and sent him back in time? Or when he restored his cloak of levitation from mere scraps? Or when he beat up Galactus and totally scrambled his brain? With his immense magical prowess, oh, Strange has survived blasts from Voltor, a robot with the power to move stars, and even withstood a supernova. At minimum, oh. an exploding star oh outputs my God, over 350 Bert. septillion gigatons of Stop TNT. That's six butt. octillion times greater than the Sar Bomba, the most powerful nuclear weapon ever made. 
Not impressed yet. Yeah, when your video starts getting in there. And detonates stars himself. Scientific dimension. Death of Sophia's supernova has weapons. Weapon. Strange, Strange is exceptionally control. clever, and while his physique is not superhuman, it's worth noting that he is a talented athlete and martial artist. This is important as the use of magic can wear down the magician's body if oh. it is unfit. His immortality has also proved incredibly useful. I'll say, um, he's looking pretty good for a guy born in the 1930s. More than that, what? at one point Strange was recruited by the oh, Vashanti to be a fight the Magical War, which lasted 5,000 years. Holy shit, I hope he got some really good veterans benefits after that. But for real, this Come guy here. has the power Come to here. protect the universe and reshape it however he wants. I know which doctor I'm calling the next time I'm sick. Supreme. Woo! Tell me, Boomstick, do you believe in fate? I only believe in one thing, Wiz. 18 year, 100 proof whiskey. Well, after accompanying his father on an archaeological expedition in Mesopotamia, 12 year old Kent Nelson certainly did. Instead of getting up. boring old artifacts like tools or pottery, Kent uncovered a 10 billion year old Wait, god. Andy. Too Physically bad waking 21. him up also gassed Kent's dad to death. This slumbering god was Nabu, a lord of order born from the very beginning of the universe. Nice, While Nabu nice. normally cares little about the universally inconsequential concerns of individual humans, uh, this time was different. Hang on. Nabu took I the will... new orphan Kent under his wing. I will be and right back. Uh... Okay, where were we? Athena's still here. She still has the fascination with standing on a my booty. Okay. The ways of magic. Oh, sweet! I'd take a god dad over an ordinary one any day. It but depends. Really, I'd just take any oh. dad. Though not really should watch wasn't that. too keen on the actual easy. parenting part of the deal. So he just magic tends to a full-grown adult over the course of a week. Does that mean he okay. got hit with all those years of awkward puberty all at once? My god, talk about a mood swing. <laughs> to master the mystic arts, Very Nabu underrated granted Kent three that. ancient relics. First and foremost, Kent donned the golden helmet of fate. Well, Kent woke up the physical body, Nabu's soul is actually inside this helmet. Yeah, so when Kent game. put it on, his Cyrus spirit merged so. with Nabu's and they became Dr. Fate. I and am an agent of order. Wait, he's 12. Technically, he can't be a doctor yet, right? Well, in time, he became a trained oh. physician and achieved a PhD in archaeology. Actually, Good. let me look that up. Let's see. Youngest doctor. This says 17. Yes, uh, he graduated from university at age 13. His name is Valamurali Ambati. Good for him, and he's 70 now. So that's pretty cool. Good for him. For him. <laughs> anyway, he's also got the Cloak of Destiny, which gave him flight, super strength, and superhuman durability. Lastly,